hello welcome and welcome back to my channel everyone in this video i share with you how to make oba nigerian delicacy for 15 to 20 persons a detailed explanation on how to make it do you use potash how do you prepare your oba keep watching because in this video i'll share with you how to make and how to serve it so let's dive into it so first i have fresh green plantain ash how do i mean now you have a green plantain you peel off the back burn that peel and allow it to cool once it gets cool gather the ash and set it aside preserve it for a use now green plantain is super healthy and is better than using potash though some people like love to use potash some do not like it and some like it all right so this is our um green plantain ash so how do we use it do we just spray it into the over not at all keep watching this video to the end because i'm giving you a detailed information on how to make it so now to get our um ash ready we need a clean bowl a cup of water depending on the quantity you want to make and a sieve you can also use a white linen for akamo and so for this quantity of oba i'm going to be making i will be using a full cup just one cup of the plant the green plantain ash and then i will transfer it into the clean bowl and to that i will add one cup of clean water and then use a turning spoon you can use a stick to turn it until it blends until the ashes mixes properly with the water exactly what you see on the screen and once it mixes properly with the water the saving process begins you get another clean bowl and begin to sieve until you sieve all the ashes it is properly clean there is no single sand on it remember when you're burning the ash you burn it on a ground or on the floor whichever way you use to burn it it's always proper you save it so you don't have any sand on it hello all my channel subscribers thank you so very much for always tuning in to watch my videos if you, this is your first time thank you so much for tuning in please do like comment share my videos to friends in, our friends and families and please do turn on the notification bell to get alerts when new videos are updated new videos are updated in this channel every week two new videos and not just videos a detailed information on how to cook recipes by root so we are making oba oba is nigerian delicious delicacy if you're coming to nigeria for the first time especially in Igbo tribe you will have to eat this it's super delicious it's simple but super expensive to make though the oba itself is super expensive so it's always they always serve it in occasions like wedding ceremonies um wedding anniversaries and so many other occasions so i sieve this up to three times and now it is ready i'm going to be saving it for the last time so this is how you extract the water you miss the ash with the water allow it to blend properly and you save everything out and then it is ready to be used keep watching and don't go away we are making oba let me know at the comment section if you do, if you know the name of the english name for oba <laughs> because i'll be leaving the english name for this oba at the comment section and for more videos on this channel please don't forget to visit the description box i have my playlist on nigerian soup recipes so now to get our bar ready i will transfer three cups of that green water a green ash water i mean green plantain ash into a clean pot and to that i'll be adding palm oil use palm oil according to the quantity of oba you want to make for this oba i'll be using 500 ml of palm oil and mix it up with 500 ml of green plantain and 
green ash green plantain ash water right so after adding it up i miss you notice the color immediately change to this yellow if you just doesn't change this yellow that means your ash is equally um it has well let's say it has it's not it's not a good one so you miss this until you get this consistency and consistency i'm showing you right now it is not too thick it is not light at all and so to this we'll be adding up the ingredients used for this oba so i have one tablespoon full of crayfish or corn one teaspoon of seasoning and one teaspoon of habanero pepper everyone habanero pepper is spicy so i go in i'm just generous with it and to that we add other things edible things you know proteins prawn stockfish the skin the fresh part of stockfish all were boiled off camera and one more like i said earlier oba is expensive to make but it's very healthy they always serve it to the edalis not just the edalis mm -hmm. mm -hmm. yes in location they serve it to selected few <laughs> and here comes the main oba this is what we call oba i believe in the name and the tree the name of the tree that it's it is gotten from on the description box so don't forget to visit that so when you add your oba you begin to miss it now for this to serve for 15 people i use oba that is up the up to 1.5 kilo of oba and then we miss this together oba is equal, equally expensive where i live let me know how you buy oba at your own side so at this point we miss now oba making this recipe you don't need to warm it you don't need to put it on fire because if we put it on fire everything will melt it will turn back to oil so what i usually do is to warm the oba if you have a microwave you microwave it or you can just steam it once you finish steam it, steaming it add it directly into the sauce and by doing that it keeps it warm so you can serve it to others all right so our bar is ready to be served so here i have some plates arranged in a bowl now some like adding bowl the onions the garden egg into the bar but for public not everyone likes that so what i do is to slice them and set them aside i will just put them on top after serving the oba so if you don't like it you can quickly separate it and go ahead with your delicious delicacy without any obstacle without any disturbance so let me know at the comment section which you prefer so here our bar is ready the first plate we're going to serve nine and the other one is six that is 15 we still go for second round so here we're adding the onions slice, sliced in a circle and we also add the garden egg so we do not want to we don't want a situation whereby someone will have to return it and say i don't like it because of onions or that so this is how we serve for the public thanks all my genuine subscribers thanks for watching don't forget to watch my playlist i have playlists on how to make nigerian soup recipes party jello fries how the smoothies detox weight loss name it they are all in this channel please visit my playlist and don't forget to share this video to your friends and families and don't forget to like comment at the comment section so i know if you like to watch something like this and if you like how i made it let me know at the comment section everyone so to serve this to go around we have to minimize and also dish in a like um share it in like in a measurements one teaspoon one tablespoon half one and a half tablespoons full you know <laughs> all right so thanks so much any subscriber for your for watching and bring your plate stay safe stay connected and see you in the next video bye